today I'm here with a new video and today I am going to do my monthly skincare video and for you that don't know every month I do one video that is about skincare and it can be different things each month last month I did my favorite skincare products of 2018 and today I'm doing I'm going to show you my current skincare routine and I okay let me just think before I must start to think before I talk <laughs> I these products I'm going to show you I use 99% of the time each and every day one product is a little extra thing but I use it like four times a week. The other products I use every day and then I use... There is other products that I don't use. Oh, oh, okay. This is my current skincare routine and the things I use on a daily basis. Plus one extra thing. So I think we just get started with a toner. And I usually use two tune... Two... Two tuner... Tuner... Toners? Two toners one in the morning and one at night but now i use the same morning and night and it's from lumina i have talked a lot about this brand when it comes to skincare this is one of my favorite brands when it comes to skincare it's a drugstore brand but they have cheaper and more expensive things because they have so many different lines so i really love lumina the most is vegan as well. I don't know if this is vegan. I don't know. Um, but this is their Radi Radiance Boosting Clarifying Toner. This is for more normal and combination skin. And it is a little bit drying for me to use both in morning and nights. But I do it now and I don't have so much left. So I'm going to use this up. Of course. Uh, I really like this one in the morning. I like to use... Um, pretty strong toner in the morning because I don't wash my face in the morning so just have a little bit stronger and purifying or a toner with vitamin C just to freshen up in the morning so this is really good for that the one thing I don't like is you can't get close to your eyes my other toner that I finished like two or three weeks uh, I could use that in my eyes and I really like that one. So that's the only thing I don't like with it. But otherwise I like it. It is a little bit much on my dry skin now in the winter. But I can work around it. And then we can go into my cleanser. And I like cheap effective cleanser. And this is one of the cheapest and a super good cleanser. And this is from Ako. It's a Swedish drugstore brand. But it's not a, a Swedish pharmacy brand. Um, and this is the Face Clean Lotion. Soft and Soothing Cleansing Lotion for dry skin. And the thing I really, really, really love about this. Is you can take away your eye makeup. And it doesn't irritate your eyes. It doesn't give you like this blurry vision for a couple of minutes. It's, it is so freaking good. I really really like this one and I have started to think that this is maybe the best face clay clean lotion I have ever tried. I have bought this so many times and I really really love it and it's cheap, it's easy to use with this pump and it takes away everything and it's good to my skin, it hydrates my skin and it has everything that I want from a cleanser. So I really like this one. If you live in Sweden... I don't know if Aqua sells in, other, in any other countries, but if you live in Sweden and have dry skin, try this because it is amazing. Then we can go into serums and I have two different serums. In the mornings I use the Ordinary Hyal Hyaluronic Acid 2% plus B5. I really love this one. I have used up so many of this and I keep buying it because it sinks into the skin so fast and it really hydrates your skin. And in the morning, I don't have the longest time for my skincare routine, so it's perfect. And I really love the aesthetic of, aesthetic of this bottle. It's clean. It's, 
what is it called in English? It's uh, one of these. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> it feels a little bit luxury, but this is a super cheap brand. This is vegan. And yeah, I really like this. I use this every morning. And it sinks in like that and you are ready to go. But on <laughs> the nights, I have a little bit more time for my skincare. I can use a little bit more... Um, this is a very lightweight product. That's why it sinks in so bad and all bad so fast. And on nights I want something that is a little bit more heavy. It can be on my face for a little bit longer because I don't I have more time in the mornings than in the mornings. So at night I use this from Illumina and this is one of their more expensive lines and this is the Nordic Ageless Radiant Youth pressed serum. So this is a serum that is in shape of cream. I love this so freaking much. Um, this is one of the best hydration serums I have ever tried. I really really love it. The, it has a little smell. I didn't like it in the beginning but it goes away very fast on your face and as you can see I have hit the bottom. <laughs> I really love this one. This is also one of the best serums I ever tried and it hydrates your face like crazy and I just I love this so much I think I will buy another one when this is empty I'm a torn because I have other skincare products but this is a super favorite I really love this one and it feels very luxurious it's heavy it's glass it's just it's just perfect I love it and then for face cream, I use now the cheapest face cream I have ever used, I think. But it's really, really good. And I use, I normally have one day cream and one night cream, but this is an all-in-one. And this is from CN. It's Lidl's own brand. And this is 24 moisturizing cream. And this is so freaking good. It, it's not so much left of this either. It smells a little bit, but it goes away and it's really nice. It goes fast into the skin, um, so I can use it in the mornings, so it's no problem. But it don't, it's not too light, but it's not too heavy. So it's perfect for both morning and evenings. I really, really like this one and this costs like 40 Swedish crowns. And that can be like maybe five dollars, so it's super cheap. No, not five dollars, maybe four dollars, four or five dollars. It's super cheap and it's super, super good. So I really like this. And the one thing I love about this, it's, it shows that skincare ha don't have to be expensive to be good. And then I have eye cream, and this is like the most expensive, one of the most expensive things I have ever bought for my skin, and it's Ole Henriksen's Banana Bright Eye Cream, and this is a, this gives a little bit, it brightens up the area, and first I was like, I, I don't even know if this do something. But, but I like it. I think I talked about this in my favorites as well. It is a good eye cream. And I think it like lightening up a little bit. Uh, yeah. But this was so freaking expensive. This was more like... It was like $40. No. Yeah. $40. Yeah. More like $40. And now I, I remember I forgot something. So I will just peep on and get it and then I will come back. Okay, I forgot like my most favorite things. I don't know how I could do it. And it's the... I have talked about this before as well. This is the Lumena Nordic Sea Glow Refresh Hydrating Mist. It looks like this. I use this every morning after I put on my skincare, my eyebrows and then I spritz this and this gives a wonderful glow. I am pretty glowy now I think but I can spray something. Mm. 
the mist is amazing for the first first of all it smells so good and if I feel so fresh I really like it I don't know if you can see any difference this is the holy grail for me if I could only use one spray I would choose this I would I can use this on makeup with a bare face just to freshen up my skin this is the holy grail I will never want to be without this um, so I don't know I can forget about this but this is my absolute favorite product like the holy grails of holy grails and then the little extra product that I use I think maybe four times a week now in the winter because the winter in Sweden where I live I hate it uh, I live by the ocean so the air is so moist it's no n the humidity is very high and my skin goes crazy uh, mostly my hands but also my face so I use this face mask like four days a week and this is from comfort zone it is Italian vegan and it's like an echo brand can you say that um, they only work I think they only have vegan products and they have very natural ingredients. I think like 97% of this is natural ingredients. And this is a Hydra Memory Mask and it's like an instant hydration. And I use this, if I have used like a scrub or anything or I just feel dry, I use this and I leave it I take a thin layer and then I let it sink in and then I go with my serum and my day night cream and everything like that. But this one, it's amazing. It smells a little bit because it is Moringa oil in it, I think. It bothers me a little, but I'm okay with it. So this is uh, so, so good. I used it yesterday and maybe today as well. But I really, really love this one. And this was the little extra one. And that was all for this video and this skincare video for February. I am so longing for this month to end. So I don't have to say February. So I can say March. Easy as that. And I really hope you like this. And I know that not all of you like skincare videos but I love skincare so I want to have one skincare video per month and I really hope you like this video if you have some good hydration or maybe good night mask please let me know because I am in the search when this is empty I want something new because this was pretty expensive even though I love skincare I don't want to spend all my money on it so, I really hope you liked this video and I will see you in the next one. Bye!